a toucan. Just your average salaryman. <laughs> I stayed up too late last night watching illegal videos. Ain't I a stinker? <laughs> it sucks that I owe money to three different loan companies, but my three girlfriends are covering my expenses for as long as I need them to. So it's all good. <laughs> What's up, everyone? Super Auto Gaming here. And today, I wanted to get out one more video about the weekly pack before it was over. And this time, it has to do with Peanut Toucan. So recently, we did a video about uh, Peanut Seagull, but it also works with Toucan, which is... Uh, pretty funny to be honest uh no one would really expect it so i think that's the biggest surprise and especially in the weekly pack however i think uh, it was still possible to get um peanut seagull in the weekly pack but there's also this one um and before we get too far into it i did want to say um i now have memberships for the channel so like i've got a few emojis set up there there's like a tier system or whatever so if you want to join that do it uh, it's, it'll be really cool. You can use some of my custom emojis, and uh, I'm always doing cursed stuff, so look forward to that. Um, also, I do want to talk about the intro, because that was absolutely ridiculous. I I was just, you know, looking up stuff for about Toucan. I think I was originally going to do something about Toucan Sam, because uh, there's a meme about that. But instead, I saw that, and I was like, what is this anime? Uh, Africa salary man that seems absolutely absurd it reminds me a bit of golden boy which is like a really old anime and it has a horrible horrible dub but it is so incredibly funny um so I I think uh, that's probably going to be one of the next things I watch so uh, it looked really really funny but anyways let's get into this game um so as you can see I already have my toucan up and Toucan works really, really well in the early game, especially with Meat Bone. It also works really well with Honey. And thankfully, we have both in uh, the weekly pack. But I prefer Meat Bone over Honey. I just feel like there's a lot of stuff that counters uh, summons right now. And Meat Bone is just so incredibly strong. That four extra attack really comes in. Um, and then, of course, as you move on, you can uh, put something... So, Unfortunately, you can't use melon or pepper with Toucan because it has to have the equipment on it when it faints. Um, so, like, I don't think steak would work either. It has to be stuff that sticks. So, like, garlic, lemon would all do fine. Of course, um, meat and actually um, peanuts does. So, of course, that's what the whole thing is about is peanuts. And at first I didn't think it would work, but then I thought about it for a second and I was like, wait, this definitely works. Like, there's no way it doesn't work. Um, so I was like, I'm going to make it my mission. I think around this time I was like, I'm going to make it my mission to get uh, walrus and get those peanuts on the toucan. So I pick up the mantis because I'm like, well, this way, if I just keep finding more and more walruses, walri then I should be able to easily keep playing them Mantis Killing, and eventually one will hit onto the man or uh, onto the Toucan, and um, then I can swap out to what my main team would be, and then boom. So it was a little bit of a, a risky play, because of course you could just keep killing Walruses over and over again, and then uh, all your units have Peanuts, and then uh, Toucan kind of doesn't make sense. But, you know, we go for it, because uh, it's always funny. And I guess, you know, we could have got like a level 3 toucan, but I thought that at this point, I think a level 2 was all I needed, because if I was to have my main setup with Mantis in the front, need the space in the middle for faint units, because uh, of course I'm going to keep Mantis, it's going to get really big really quickly, it'll probably be, you know, one of the main carries, of course. And then toucan in the middle, and then two things in the back, and I decided rooster was probably going to be one of them, because rooster is insanely strong, uh, you know, if you get it to have enough attack, you get a bunch of chicks out of it, super strong, always has been, uh, used to be even stronger, so. And um, here I was like, yeah, we can easily go for a level 3 mantis, we've already found so many and it's turn 9. Uh, but what we're really looking for is our final unit. Right now I have a cat, but I think something that works a bit more with summons can can do better. So something like a turkey or a spinosaurus, which I believe both are in this. Uh, shark also works really well. So that was amazing uh, stork hit, by the way, getting the, the rooster out of that. And I wanted the, the level up there, so played the peach. 
Um, then we play the cow because we have enough gold and we find the walrus, which is really, really good. And we can sell both the cow and the, the cat and get shark in there. Um, and this will be a pretty good setup for this turn because shark would be good with a uh, rooster. So. so there we now have the walrus where we should be able to get something. Uh, hopefully we can hit the toucan, but you know, that's not always the case here. We're going to find out. Hopefully it doesn't hit the rooster because I really want the croissant on it. Thankfully, it, le it at least hits the shark and I immediately, uh, our next shop has another walrus for us so we get another chance. Uh, fly could have worked pretty well here, but I think I wanted something a bit better than shark. It's a bit too slow for turn 11. Also, um, I don't like, you don't really want your last unit to already have peanuts. Like it doesn't matter. It'd probably be better to put something like uh, a pepper uh, just to make sure it doesn't get sniped in the very beginning and then or like a lemon garlic anything like that and then uh, you can have toucan override it with the peanut at least that was my thought process so here boom we finally hit it that's what i've been wanting to see um and we can easily get a level three mantis and now we don't need the other walrus really but this turn we are going to have to sacrifice something and I decide Spino is much, much better than Shark because of uh, how Rooster spawns so many chicks. You get a lot more stats uh, in the end. So we're going to sacrifice the Shark. It doesn't matter anymore either. Peanuts, meh. It's fine. At level 3 Mantis too, pretty cool. I don't think I had the level 3 Mantis uh, badge, so it was cool to get it. Ludwig lol. We got Ludwig wrecked. And, yeah, we're easily going to get the melon onto the mantis. It's going to be big, quick. And now we can get, um, try to go for a level 2 Spino and a level 3 Rooster. We're finding a lot of Roosters here. Uh, unfortunately, every turn we do have to put something behind the mantis so it doesn't kill our uh, Peanut Toucan. That'd be really, really bad. And here it finally comes into play. Getting the Peanuts honestly didn't do that much. But I think uh, if you were to face like a big dog butterfly team, especially since this is the weekly, then this team, it will absolutely destroy it. So, yep, get an anteater in there. That's perfectly fine. Uh, we're on the ninth win. Let's see if we can finish it up here. This is a bit of a summon build, though. Um, so we might not be able to do as well. The peanuts, though. Oh, and it's just barely a tie. So we do get one more chance to get something great. We could easily get the level 3 rooster here, which will probably guarantee our winning. Oh, I knew it that time. Yeah, save the eagle. It's uh, really, really good to have as the last unit. We don't need stego there. So, um, But overall, this, this was a really fun game. Sadly, we do have to get... Uh, the eagle in there, we can't get the level th uh, level 2 Spino, but if we do lose next turn, we easily could. Um, but anyways, try this out for yourself if you do get the chance to. And honestly, oh, this is a perfect team to go against too. Um, and honestly, you can uh, do this in customs too, so it's totally viable there. Uh, but anyways, thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And you know what? Have a fantastic day.